Hurricane Dorian has shut down campus, but it has not stopped the educational process. What we've learned from prior hurricanes is we don't want to absolutely shut down classes. Measures are in place at Coastal Carolina University to ensure that learning does not come to a halt when there is an unexpected disruption. We're very lucky that we can shift a lot of our instruction to online interfaces. The step from traditional learning to online learning isn't that big a step anymore. Faculty members can post assignments, readings, videos, and even lectures online. Each year, we've had more tools in hand to make sure that there can be a meaningful educational experience even during a campus closure. Many instructors have already begun to plan in case hurricane season produces a storm which impacts the university. I know anecdotally a lot of our faculty had already built um, weather interruption modules. There are official places where you can get information. Details about the academic continuity plan are always communicated to students, but interim provost Dan Ennis is going beyond that with this closure by sending out informative videos. We're gonna to try to get more content out there that corresponds with and aligns with the messaging we're doing through traditional means. The goal is to effectively communicate with the entire campus community. Your students will be safe and back soon. We miss them. Including family members of students. What we're gonna to try to do is supplement the emails that we're sending directly to students with um, some videos that can be posted to social media that are likely to be viewed by family members. The academic continuity plan allows for students to get all of the course material they need without falling far behind in regard to the calendar. We've had students actually express gratitude that there was the ability to keep working 